Hi guys, greetings, this is your girl Connie from Passion for Fitness. I'm sending you another boot, I mean a boot camp video. Uh, this is our fourth week, going into our fourth week, and the time goes by so fast. I cannot thank you guys enough for choosing Passion for your morning workouts and for your fitness journey. I have, have enjoyed each and every one of you so far, and I hope to continue that. We're going to continue that, right? And I hope you have been enjoying the process of boot camp and us being indoors and outdoors and everything. And we're almost done with this, this, this challenge. And I just want to take this time out to continue to encourage each and every one of you guys just to stay the course. Make sure you're eating your meals or I'm not just eating your meals, but eating your meals in a timely manner. You want to eat every two and a half to three hours. Uh, stay as close as possible in that time range. It keeps your body fuel and you don't have them high ups and low crashes and things such as that. So it keeps you balanced throughout the day. So it's so important you time your meals and also to stay on the meal plan. At this point, if you have not lost any weight, you probably start noticing in your clothes. That's initially where you start noticing things as far as the inches in your clothes and how your clothes feel on you. At this, after this week here, or if you have not lost any weight, I want you to contact me. I want you to talk to me because at this stage, you start should start seeing some changes in the scale. And if you're not, let's communicate. Let's talk about it. Uh, again, like I said, in camp, if you was not there, make sure that you're doing the things you need to do outside of my eyesight so it will show on the scale and that you will be happy with your progress after the challenge. It's a partnership. It doesn't come in a bottle. You can't take a pill and make the weight go away or anything such as that. It'd be a great idea if you could, but we can't. So that being said, make sure you're doing what you're supposed to do when you're not in my eyesight. I only get the pleasure of seeing you only three days after the week, and it's just 45 minutes um, each session. So a lot of that is on you for us to make sure you continue to get your workouts in and also stay on the meal plans and do the things you need to do. Get plenty of rest, too. Make sure you get your rest in. It makes a, a big difference in your training, and it's part of your training. So guys, continue to do what you're doing. Stay consistent. I cannot thank each and, our, each and every one of you enough. I have loved the camaraderie in this group. You're always encouraging each other, and it makes a big difference. Continue to do that. And remember, we still had Adrian right with us. He came to the studio this past Saturday and actually worked out with us in Club Boss. Can you believe that? He ran outside with me and did the class. So God is an awesome God. He can restore and make even better. So that blessed my heart to see him walk into that studio. We also had uh, Davis, Lynette Davis, run the Ronald Reagan this past Saturday. Uh, 10K, she did a fantastic job. It's always great to see you guys go over and beyond what we're doing at Passion for Fitness. Also, congratulations to Miss Christina Love. Love did an awesome poem today at church in which I had the pleasure of hearing, and it was absolutely fantastic. Um, Thank you for inviting me. Thank you. I love things such as that, and it blessed my heart. Girl, you're awesomely talented. Not only are you just great in fitness, but you're an awesome poet, so continue to do that. We also had Vita, who had an awesome women's presentation or weekend at her church, so I hope and pray that all went well. Guys, let me know what's going on in your world outside of fitness, and if it's something that I can attend, if it's something that I can support uh, as far as passion for fitness and supporting, please let me know. Uh, all of this come together. Fitness is part of the component that makes you do what you need to do outside of fitness so much more better. I must say, love, you looked fantastic in your dress today at church. And I have to say, I, I contribute to that, I would like to think. So guys, continue to do what you're doing. I'm so proud of each and every one of you. I'm again enjoying this journey. And again, if you have any questions, any concerns, feel free to contact me. Until then, guys, I will see you bright and early Monday. God bless.